Yo, welcome back, y'all. Serial Pajamas here. We're gonna try to get as far as possible in Resident Evil 4, the remake today. I'm having a really good time in this game. Um, it's just a beautiful game, and uh, the controls have improved so much. They've put so much work into it, and I'm just so honored to have survived through the pandemic long enough so that I could see not just my kids grow old, but Resident Evil 4, the remake. So my last playthrough, I killed a couple dudes here in this hallway. Um, look, I don't know about you, but I thought it was real strategic. I felt pretty good about the fact that I lured them into this little hallway, narrowed them down like fish in a barrel, and just knocked them all out one by one. However, uh, I don't know what to do now. A little stuck. Should I? I mean, I really want to conserve ammo. Nothing sh good should come of killing the cows. I, I mean, they don't drop, like, milk bottles or something that helps with my health. Or, you know, you can't, like, eat their udders for sustenance. Do udders taste good? Like, has anyone ever tried an udder? If everything else on a cow tastes good, does an udder taste good? You would think an udder would taste good. Oh! Oh, my desk is going up! Uh, let's lock that into place. Take me home! Where, where am I supposed to go? What the heck am I supposed to do? Oh, there's a door over here. Okay, that's new. I mean, this this whole uh, like labyrinth is new. This was not in the last one. Oh, I think I saw a blue medal. Can I just cut it? That looks a little too high to cut. Come here! Jump, Leon! Need one more blue medal and then we're good to go, boys. And girls. And they thems. Ooh, a flagon! I wonder what the flagon is for. Pesetas, gunpowder. I think if I just keep kicking this, yep. When in doubt, just keep kicking. Just keep kicking, just keep kicking. I hope that's not copyrighted. And what's in this box? This tells me I can jump through this. No? Really? It's got yellow tape. Yellow tape is usually a sign of something that could be like broken through. Oh, I am drinking black coffee. Oh, wooden cog. Kitchen knife. What's the kitchen knife for? Is that like a backup knife? So like when my Bowie knife breaks, I have a kitchen knife? Yay! <laughs> I could take down a Squirrel. Here we go. Yeah. All right. Brain power. A little backup knife. Its edge chips easily. So there must be like different forms of knives in this game. Knives. Knives. Lives. Lives. So there's uh, the combat knife. It's been my go-to since my time at RPD. It's like a family heirloom. It's, that's just about to whittle away because I've been... Cutting chickens too much. A lot of foraging in this game so far. Not enough action. Come on, pick it up, Leon. <clears throat> this coffee is so black. It, it just, it tastes like straight up mud. Oh, I don't even know why I like that. What are you doing? Oh, what the? Evade, evade! Okay, so you were supposed to press B to evade, but I just kept backing up and that did the trick, I guess. What are you looking at, huh? Oh, they're throwing stuff at me. All right, let's just keep running. Go over the rocks, Leon. I can't go over the rocks. Whoa, where did he come from? That hurt. Where did he come from, seriously? Let's, hey, now's a good time to expand that health bar. So as you can see in the bottom right, my health bar expanded overall. I'm not gonna bother them. They can just keep tossing stuff at me. Oh crap, she's charging. Okay, we need to keep moving. Is that your tactic? Just keep ducking? <laughs> what are you doing? I can't wait to meet the merchant. Again with this? Oh, that's actually fine. Hey, come here, buddy. Come here. Come here, guys. Boys and girls. Oh, they have dynamite. Steady. Come on. 
Come on, dude. Ha <laughs> ha! Idiot. You probably set that trap, too. I gotta work on my, uh, shooting the axes as they fly. There we go. Boom! Muay Thai push kick. Get them both. Nice. Alright, just stab him. It's all good. Well, that was your favorite knife, Leon. It's your favorite knife and it's gone. I think that Capcom has really learned a lot from The Last of Us. I'm seeing a lot of um, inspiration from The Last of Us in this game. I prefer them scrambled, but I guess hard-boiled will have to do. What a throw! Oh no. Now is not the time for this. They're throwing dynamite. I'm gonna hold up here. Let them come to me. Wait a minute, where did that land? Oh my god! What a throw! Oh. That's what happens when you're in a building with no roof. You know, in the last Resident Evil 4, your enemies were really bad at throwing dynamite. They would often kill themselves. I could use a little bit of that old stuff now. Show yourself, dynamite tosser. Feels like a racial slur. It isn't, though. Oh, there you are. I see you. If I can shoot the dynamite in her hand. She knows I see her. That's some good AI right there. Headshots will have to do. Okay. Kind of anticlimactic, but all right. Oh, no. Really? I just cut his dynamite. Like, should it really explode in that situation? This is a kind of a new variation. This is kind of like the guy that attacked me in the beginning of the game. What should I be aiming for here? Wow, what a waste of a perfectly great kitchen knife. It was gonna cut me some avocados later. I don't like this. Ooh, a loot. How should I handle this? Well, I don't have a knife, so. Gonna run up and knife him. And stay down. Was it really that hard for that guy to get in here? I, I, I did it pretty easily, and he had an axe. This is creepy. I didn't sign up for this! Should I shoot it? Hey! That hurts, you know? Seemed like you really wanted to talk. How observant, senor. Now, uh, say, uh, you got a smoke? Joder! Not this guy! Who are you? Oh! The chieftain! This is basically early game tyrant. The Spanish Mr. X. Or is it Mr. T? I think Mr. T is taken, so I don't think it's Mr. T. Alright, we did it! Chapter results. Okay. Hardcore. Enemies killed. I died four times, but you don't need to know that. As far as you know, I died three times. Um, accuracy is 76. Not bad. 76? That's how I got through college. 
was a 76 average student. You would think I would have been an A student with all the cheating I did. They can't take away your degree after you get it, right? Especially after a couple years. It's got to be like a statute of limitations. It begins 